Hi everyone, this is Nick with Motoloader, and I'm talking about platform configuration today and extensions. So when you need them, uh, what is an extension on the platform and what it could be used for. So this, this is our kind of our final prototype build. It's a little rough around the edges. We've been testing the crap out of it, uh, beating it up, and it's, it's handled everything really well. Uh, the final, you know, what we're shipping is now powder coated. So it's a much uh, more durable finish than what uh, we used on this one. So as you're probably familiar, the, the extension that we have up there is used for the base frame. So it basically allows us to add the final set of wheels and the uh, receiver and adapter system, that, that center wheel. It allows us to install that on the tailgate when we need it when we're loading and unloading, and it allows us to remove it and stow it up there when we're not loading and unloading so that we can close the tailgate. Now on a long bed truck like this, uh, we don't need an extension for the platform because the full length of the platform can be uh, stowed in the bed and I can close the tailgate. Uh, and when I'm loading motorcycles, I can fit a whole motorcycle in here. Uh, I won't have any overhang, it all fits within the bed. And that's unique to the fact that this is a long bed truck. Now, for those of you with a shorter bed, you know, five or six foot, it's very likely that what you're loading, uh, will, will you will need some sort of overhang for the platform. And so for you to be able to close the tailgate with the platform stowed, that's where you'll need an extension for the platform as well, in addition to the standard base extension. So it would essentially be another extension like that that would attach to the platform and when you're loading your equipment or your motorcycle or whatever it may be the extension is connected and when you're not loading and you want to keep your platform in the bed you can remove that extension leave it at home or put it on top and then you can close your bed now the most cost effective option is to build a platform like this with no extension if we add extensions that's you know, there's additional cost to fabricate that. Um, so for those of you, this is a decision that you need to make on, do I want to be able to haul around a platform, an empty platform uh, when I'm not carrying my equipment or my, or my motorcycle or ATV, whatever it may be, um, or when I'm, not, when I'm not hauling, do I leave my platform at home or, or a place of work or wherever you want to keep it? Um, so we're happy to quote both options, but just for you to understand, when you may need an extension for the platform uh, or not. In terms of installing, it's very straightforward. There's basically just two assemblies here. We've got the base frame on the bottom. Uh, this, is, this is a very simple, just rectangular frame uh, that holds the winch. Uh, it holds these wheels, your guiding mechanism, and, uh, and then you tie it down to the truck. We, you have the option to tie it down or bolt it down, but the most popular is to tie it down. So. These uh, D-rings can be welded and fabricated based on your specific tie-down locations in, in the bed of your truck. Um, and then the second part is the platform, which goes on top of the base. So once the base is installed with the winch, the winch is wired up, uh, then the platform can be connected to the winch cable and it can be loaded onto the truck. Or you can manually you know, put it on the truck the first time at least. So that's pretty much what it takes to install it. And, and if you're tying it down, there's no holes to be drilled in the bed or anything like that. Uh, the extension just sits on the tailgate. There's no uh, modification needed to that. Um, and then your, this is the hitch support. So if you have a hitch on your truck and you're loading anything really over like 500 pounds, we recommend using a hitch support just to give your tailgate a break. Um, that is usually you know, custom fabricated based on the, the hitch location and is also ready to go uh, out of the box. So hope that helps explain a little bit about how, you know, when you need an extension, uh, what it might be useful for depending on the size of your bed and how to install the system into the bed of your truck.